no joke, out of um, all the TV shows I've probably ever watched, even ones I haven't reviewed, Iron Fist is probably one of the worst shows I've ever seen. So I'm definitely glad I put it off for as long as I did. It's just so fucking boring. All the characters are so bland. The first few episodes were okay, I guess. But after that, I just hated it, and it was a drag to get through. I was on episode 12, so only two episodes left. And I still waited three days to finish it. Because I just didn't want to watch it. I don't like this show at all. It's just really bad. There's some funny jokes here and there. And then there's some really bad dialogue with Claire. Who Claire is one of my favorite characters throughout the Marvel series. She's in um, Daredevil, she's in Luke Cage, she's in every Netflix project, and she was a badass. And I almost all the time agreed with her when she was saying shit. And then she's kind of goofy and doesn't do too much. She still acts a bit like her. Like when she decides, fuck it, I'm gonna help Danny and Colleen in the final episode. And she starts a fire. That's kind of like her. She would probably do that with Luke Cage or Daredevil. But, you know, she still wasn't the best. There's a scene where she confronts Colleen during a very serious moment. She feels betrayed. The people Colleen's been working with murdered her friends, right? Well, she makes a joke about why didn't, um, if she's like the good hand, there's a bad hand, then why isn't she called the ear or the elbow? It's just so cringy. Why? Why did you think that was a good line? Especially coming from Claire. Come on now. The only um, character that I really cared for in this show was Ward. And I still didn't care for him that much. He had kind of an interesting character arc that they didn't do much with. There's this guy, Kyle, that they completely forget about. He's the assistant, and him and Ward are the only people that know Harold are alive. We get that confirmed later when Danny finds out Harold is alive. He goes, I had to beg to let my assistant and Ward know, which the assistant is Kyle. Kyle, I'm pretty sure, is only in like the first two episodes, and they just forget about him. Maybe, maybe he's in the third episode. And then he's mentioned in the scene where, um, you know, um, the thing I just talked about. Then after that, he is never there again until he gets killed. He comes back, has a random line about how he likes ice cream. Harold gets some ice cream, but he doesn't get vanilla. He gets a bunch of fancy flavors and he's like hey do you have vanilla and Harold gets pissed and kills him then he's only mentioned one more time in the show when Ward is like has Kyle even been around and she's like who and they don't even explain who that is the last time poor Kyle was mentioned and he was even that interesting of a character that I still cared about him more than half the fucking cast The show is just so fucking bland. I don't know what they were going for. There's no good villains either. We get this one dude that I'm pretty sure the episode opens up with him like singing to a microphone. He kills some guys. If this was Luke Cage or Punisher or Daredevil, Jessica Jones, he would probably would have been the main villain. And they would have to tough fighting him in the last few episodes of the season. But no, he just shows up later, gets his ass kicked. Gao is like, hey, if you finish beating his ass, then I'm going to kill the girl. And then we never see him again. And then there's 
the dude that is the hand that is also related to Colleen, I think. He was her brother, but I don't give a fuck. And he gets killed by Davos, and then he's gone. Then we get Harold in the final, that boring-ass, half-ass battle, where he gets shot by Ward and falls off a building, and now he's dead. Even though the show already explained that the only way to kill him is to remove his head from his shoulder. So unless they did that off screen and just decided not to mention it, he should not be dead. He gets cremated and I guess that's the end of him even though like I've already stated. It was literally in the episode before too so it's not like something they should have forgot. Episode 12, episode 13. Do the math. They shouldn't have forgot that fast. Um, it's just so stupid. Um, then the season ends with not one but two dumb cliffhangers where Davos turns out to be kind of evil and he's like, hey, I'll kill Iron Fist for you and Joy agrees, who is probably the most kind of kind-hearted character throughout the show. She was just, uh, you know, not as evil as everybody else character. So it's definitely a bit weird. And then the other thing is that um, a bunch of the hand got killed and now the place has moved and Iron Fist blames himself and we get to see his dumb CGI yellow fist one last time before the fucking show ends. I wish it would have ended there. I could care less. But now I gotta sit through ten more episodes. But after that, I'll be moving on to something else. Thank God. Because this is honestly the worst show I've ever seen. Ever. It, it doesn't even deserve the 33% or whatever. it got. I know it's in the 30s. It should have got a zero. This show is awful. 